Welcome to the Investors Trading Academy Talking Glossary of Financial Terms and Events. Our word of the day is high frequency trading. High frequency trading became popular when exchanges began to offer incentives for companies to add liquidity to the market. For instance, the New York Stock Exchange has a group of liquidity providers called Supplemental Liquidity Providers, also known as SLPs, which attempt to add competition and liquidity for existing quotes on the exchange. As an incentive to the firm, the NYSE pays a fee or rebate for providing said liquidity. As of 2009, the SLP rebate was 0.0015 of a dollar. Multiply that by millions of transactions per day and you can see where part of the profits for high frequency trading comes from. The SLP was introduced following the collapse of Lehman Brothers in 2008, when liquidity was a major concern for investors. High frequency trading uses complex algorithms to analyze multiple markets and execute orders based on market conditions. Typically, the traders with the fastest execution speeds will be more profitable than traders with slower execution speeds. As of 2009, it's estimated more than 50% of exchange volume comes from high-frequency trading orders.